my AR is sweating. <laughs> Howdy y'all and welcome back. Just brought this from the nice icy cold air condition to the rather swampy garage out here and it it's sweating like a like a can of coke or something. <laughs> anyway, that clip you saw right there is me doing my tactical turtle. I am M16A2 old and I have a lot of years of crouching down behind a rifle and shooting like that. And I'm working on breaking that habit. One thing was the elevated riser from Primary Arms for the Cyclops gets it up a little higher. And now we're adding the Fear, that's Field Expedient Elevated Riser from SC Irregulars. That's Slade, if you follow the Tactical Instagrams and YouTube. Uh, Slade, who used to be with GBRS Group, former Navy SEAL, developed this, and it works in conjunction with a Magpul CTR stock. So it is kind of like limited to that stock. I happened to, of course, have one of these laying around. This one's actually for a commercial buffer tube, so I need to pick one up for a proper mil spec because it's got a little bit of movement and it kind of bugs me. But for now, just trying to get into the whole concept of the upright shooting. And so the idea here is you bring your optic up and then you bring your cheek weld up so that you can mount the gun, something more like that, as opposed to coming down and doing that. Watching a lot of footage of my recent training, I'm losing like a full, not a full second, but a good like six tenths of a second or something on every stage, every time I'm like up, bringing up my AR, I'm coming down to it and that takes time. And so if I could just shave some of that time off and maintain a more erect posture throughout the day, it helps avoid getting that crunched up like neck jive going on. Long day of training, long day at the range. I pretty much always have a bit of a headache and a lot of that generates from back here because I tactical turtle. So I've been working on that with my pistol shooting. I, it's a little better, but I still do it. And I mostly do it like on a stage or like in a drill when I'm not, like I'm focusing on the shooting and not my posture. So the, the old muscle memory slips back in as it does. And I get back into that deal. So really working on snapping in more like that instead of that. So anyway, always experimenting, always trying new things and challenging myself. And hopefully this will be helpful in that quest. So I'll keep y'all posted how it goes. It'll be a minute before I get this over to the range. But when I do, I'll let you know. That's all I got for today. Until next time, be easy, y'all.